And then the issue becomes, well, what kind of performance enhancement would you have gotten had you gone with 11 channels versus 7 like I did in my system? And I would argue from my experience that while, yes, the 11 channel system might sound a little bit more immersive, the difference is small compared to the compromises I would have to stay within budget and, and less than equipment. So had I gone, for instance, with, I don't know, R-series speakers, which I went with the S-series more because I just wanted to be able to show people those. The R-series is a really good speaker. That would have been a good way to lower the cost and go with more channels. But it, it is a lower output speaker, and it doesn't sound quite as good. So I would have had some small compromises there. The lower output I don't think would be an issue in my room because I'm not anywhere near the limits of what the speakers could do, but they don't make an R7i. And I really wanted the vertical directivity capabilities of the 7 series. So I had to go with an S. But let's just say I went with the R5i. Again, I don't think I would have been at the limit of its output. I would have been OK. But then, like I said, I would have had to have gone to a higher channel count processor. That would have been very costly. And the whole system would have just gotten more expensive. So like I said, my opinion would be that that's just not worth it. 